Stewart, and I'm playing Charlie Brown in You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown. I think, I think most people think of him as, as kind of a loser. As we've been going through the process of deconstructing the script and, and taking a look at old comic strips, he's, uh, he's a pretty fascinating guy. He, he never wins, but he keeps trying. He always goes out and he tries to fly the kite, no matter how many times the kite falls down and he fails completely. He always gets back up and every day is a new day and he always tries. Uh, I'm Steve Patterson and I'm playing Snoopy. You've probably never seen Snoopy like this before, but you'll, you'll get it because that's what Snoopy does, you know? He just kind of takes you on those journeys. Snoopy, oh God, it's, it's, it's his best friend. Best friend in the world. I, I, think, I think Charlie Brown has a different perception of what their relationship is mm -hmm. versus what Snoopy thinks. Of. There are two things that uh, Snoopy wants and that's to be fed and to be loved. And, uh, and Charlie Brown can basically supply both those things. Food and a good scratch on the head. That's what I'm looking for. My name is Erica Peck and I'll be playing Lucy. Lucy is a strong personality. One of the things that's hilarious about her is that most of her statements are not thoughts or opinions, they are declarations of truth. It's the bomb. <laughs> My name is Kevin Yi and I'm playing Linus. I think he's kind of everybody's younger brother, and he's a really sweet guy and uh, very intelligent. He loves his blanket, of course, but he's he's a really great guy. I think that I love her because she is my big sister, but she's a little mean to me. She likes to uh, bully me a little bit, <laughs> and she's sometimes right. No, she's never right. We just challenge each other, right? With a brother and a sister, you're always just trying to one-up each other. So it's not so much our, our relationship that gets challenged, but we're always challenging our positions, you know? We're always trying to get that hand on top of the bat. And she always tries to tell me what to do, which is not always right. And so then I get a little mad. So we fight a little, but at the end of the day, love. It's, it's love. It's totally love. One-sided love. I'm Amy Wallace, and I play Sally. She's described as being an enigma in the show, and I think that that is maybe what she is. She's the youngest, so she's sort of just trying to find her way in the world, trying to figure out how to, how to interact with people, but she doesn't have a lot of boundaries yet. So anything can happen with Sally. I'm Andrew Broderick, and I'll be playing Schroeder. I think Schroeder is the mysterious lover in the show, but a lover of music, which is, is pretty sweet to play. Um, it's an honor to play someone who is so artistically driven and, and uh, about his artistic accomplishments. I think Schroeder sees Sally as a fighter and a free spirit, and um, he tries to bring some reality into her world. He's very straight edge, you know, and I think that she respects that. She sees him as, I think, a very intelligent guy, someone to look up to, but he, he's, he's very focused for her, and she's not so super focused. Schroeder and Sally get to sing a song, My New Philosophy, uh, where we kind of explore the power shifts that, that go on in the world. Wow. 